And it looks like Xantaris will discover that it's alive. There's no one up there. Fast at the top mid take comes through, but Olaf Meister doing the damage from point. A great flick there for the third frag. Goes in for the quad kill. Really hard to correctly check everything against the pistols so you can kind of like lurk around. But instead it's just Regon here. He's going to have to do something really ridiculous. Maybe this will be it. There's two. Oh, oh. my god. He gets all three. That is that is ridiculous. Yeah. You don't have so much room to play off of each other if you, you haven't gone through the choke point. Yeah. Well, the bait set up. Will it even be needed? The rifle is heard, but Tabson's got all three frags. And last round they lost two towards IV. This time they lose, they lose three and the bomb. So. Breezy slowly go. walking up mid. Yeah, walking into the crossfire. We saw this before, the top mid stack. And suddenly, I don't know, quadruple peak coming in there from Complexity. And they get no damage from it. Let's have some Ferrari peak in the uh, squeaky position. Rain doesn't go all the way. Flash is avoided. What happens to the flashbang? Perhaps it went behind him. That was really weird. That looked spot on. Yeah, we should get, we can get a replay of that, slow it down. That'd be pretty sick. I remember a flashbang which patches on Inferno, which just went behind the tiniest bit and didn't flash anybody. But it's the end of the line here, I think, on train two versus five now. Cold and Brokey. Brokey's on fire as well. More flashes to come. There goes the last one from next. Avoided, but it's double peak, and that's going to be it. 16 to five, a massive scoreline for Big at the end of train. Out of smoke, waiting for a peak from the CTs. Quietly repositioning. Will he get there in time? He sees one player emerging from the ramp, but it's Nico. There is no good option, though, really, on phase, is there? Smuya now in control, moving down to the double doors. Catching Cold Zero off guard. One versus one now, Wolof Meister. Trying to bait a peak. He's got to go for the quick scope. Not going to work out. Smuya will finish off the job. The passive approach of the CTs. And speaking of which, we get a push into the ladder room, which is timely here through Ethan because we're going to get the totem drop coming in. It seems he's taking some heat. Circus is able to get a pick towards up a B. Meanwhile, as Ethan still has position here, they may not expect this. We get Daps down to two, spots two players, and everyone's rotating in time. The fight for IV continues. It has been lost by Cloud9. That makes the bomb fun a lot harder. Circ continues to be Circ. He sees the trajectory. Maybe the molly was supposed to go between the trains, it doesn't, and Cirque's still on the train. That leaves Mixwell alone. He sees Cirque, but he can't do much about it. It's like, wow, how do we play with this? Yeah. How do our ears still work? A big presence in the short B position. The automatic will run distraction now from behind the water. He gets another OK automatic. Three kills for him. Looking for a Deagle Ace and basically an eco round. He's one of the remaining two players. Art oh, has a look again, and there's a 4 for automatic, and now he's got a 1v1 for the fifth. The leads are too much for them. Oh, oh my <laughs> god! <laughs> Snags is going to be denied. Acor just, he's ready for all the angles. He's that free for all deathmatch battle sniper. Pretty nice to have. There's a shadow advantage for him now as well. He spots one towards the truck, and he's going to fall as well. He's going to run out the race. Maybe he is. Ooh. Absolutely. Two aces and one half from Acor. With a defensive drag onto Cold Zero, not much that Nico could do here, you'd imagine. One versus three as he creeps in from Porch. They don't know where he is just yet, but they have players covering everything. Two players on site, one in pits, completely is totally ideal for this kind of a a play, or any play really. It's a good default setup. And Nico's just looking to try to catch somebody here. He needs to get given a free one to entertain the chances for, to do this. There is one. Number two comes in. And he's got the third. Nico. He's got time as well. Beautiful quad kill. They moved off the mark just a little bit too soon. And Nico with the full punish. Oh my god. Especially considering every player has some names. Oh, it's Twisted Forest to get the kills though. And oh, oh my what? god! What on earth was that? He's still going! He's still going! He's still going! He's still And he's going to win the round with the help of Rez. That didn't make sense. That was nasty. That didn't make sense. It didn't look like his crosshair was actually there or that he had an angle. Yeah. I see kind of going in one by one. Kind of rushing things here. Trying to punish that initial plant. He's got no kit man. Oh, I like this. Automatic oh burning. No, no. Oh, he got it. He's, he's <laughs> shooting too fast. Oh my god. What an absolute baller.